All right, guys, we are back again uh, with Mike P's teas and such. A mic, of course. Uh, that's Rosie. Hey, baby. Um, really bugging me that I wasn't able to get any footage. Okay, girl, go on. I know. Really bugging me that I wasn't able to get any footage last time um, due to my phone being my phone. But today is sling feeding day, and I figured I'd give you guys a little bit of something since I did not have an actual feeding video uh, on my channel yet. So I'm going to stop talking and we'll get to feeding some tarantulas. All right, first up is the Pyrmenia. Let's see if we can't get a actual shot this time. Maybe. Sorry for my hands, they shake. I wonder if it might be in pre-molt. Let's see. Nope. Uh, as soon as I put it down, she takes it. Of course. Hmm. So, I do have a camera coming. Uh, hopefully it will be better than my phone. I don't think there are many things that, oh, no, not that, one, that aren't better than my phone as far as cameras go. Alright. Here we have P. Marinus. And it actually just molted, so we will see. I imagine it's hungry. I will actually be surprised if it does not eat. It has not eaten since I have gotten it. And it has been a week since it molted. I guess I could just fill that water dish up too, couldn't I? I'm going to leave you guys on it just in case. So I think that it might not eat because I've moved its enclosure from where it actually is. Um, so I am going to leave the roach in there for a day and uh, take it out if it has not eaten and then try again on Sunday with the mass feeding. Next up we've got the little Taya Tiger. I think this, yeah, this is definitely the most aggressive sling I have owned so far. And it's definitely given the GBB, or the C cyanopubescence, a run for its money on its web making. I think this thing webbed in the first day, the very center funnel that you see. And this guy always eats every time. But he did molt about a mm, month, month and a half ago, maybe. So he might be coming up on another one, which would be the only reason that I could think he would not eat. Alright, so if he doesn't eat like this, then he just won't eat. Oh, there he is. And there he goes. Maybe I can get a little bit of a view for you. There he is. Or it. I don't know why I say it. Or 
he and she and only for certain ones but that is kind of how I am I guess and last but not least is the C. Lividum and I don't think this one is gonna feed live I usually have to crush the head and just drop it next to the hole but I do see his little feet and I can't tell if it's his butt or if it's his face but usually as soon as I move his enclosure he's done for about an hour like I won't even see his toes at the entrance to his tunnel so yeah I'm just gonna pre-kill and then drop it on his front door here we go and I'll probably see him munching on that here in about an hour or two if that okay so those are all my slings as of now. I was supposed to get the Hapalopus Columbia species large today, but that got pushed back till tomorrow. So there might be another video tomorrow. It depends on what I get them in. If they can stay in their enclosures that I get them in for another molt, I will probably leave them in there and I will obviously feature and feed on Sunday's feeding. Um, Let's see, am I forgetting anything? Oh, um, I have scorpions on the way, two of them. Deathstalker um, and a Parabuthus transvelicus, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Do not know, but um, hopefully those will be here Saturday. So maybe, we'll definitely feature them in Sunday's video but I don't know if they're going to eat. Like I've said, sometimes I have had trouble within the first week uh, to week and a half of actually getting them on a feeding schedule. Uh, but usually once I get them on that feeding schedule, they usually do pretty well. I think all of my larger scorpions have been on their same routine and they have not refused a meal at least the last three or four weeks. Um, the little ones, the last video I tried the Sunday feeding they all ate stung took down live prey items so um, hopefully we'll be able to recreate that this weekend with the the rest of the animals um, but yeah I think that's gonna be all for now I'm gonna quit talking right after this thanks uh, thanks subscribers uh, Anything you guys particularly want to see, uh, leave a comment, obviously, and uh, like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.